since I was very, very young, I think since I was four or five or something like this, I remember that I was really fascinated by colors and uh, uh, lights and dark. I want my work to do for the viewer the same thing that music does for me. So when I've listened to a piece of music that I really love, it touched me, it, it touched my subconscious mind, it revealed many imagination in me and it revealed questions and whatever and I want my work to do the same for the viewer, that's what I hope. So each time I start a new canvas, I try to think, I try to, uh, to forget all my knowledge, knowledge about painting. I try to empty my head mm -hmm. uh, because I think the, the main source of uh, cre uh, creativity comes from uh, the subconscious mind. When you empty your head and when you forget everything you know, you know about anything, uh, you will reach, uh, you will discover something in your personality and also maybe in, your, in the life. Um, I mean, let's talk about scale a little bit because yeah. none of these are small. They're all on a really big scale. How does that come about? Why, why always so large? I love, work, I love to work on a big uh, scale uh, because I think for me, it's, it's, uh, I feel more free in working on the big scales and also everything big is, is, has a double impact on anything. <coughs> and uh, I just enjoy it. What about finding your style, your own style? How did you go about that? Um, I didn't, I haven't think about finding my own style. I always used to think that each person is different than other. I think it's a struggle for many, art, well, a struggle, I think it's hard for many artists because they're trying to stand out from everyone else. Yeah, but if they don't try to stand out, they will stand out. I, I was curious about what you think you've taken away from this residency. Is there anything that will change in the way you approach your work or in what you think you might make next that's come out of this project? Uh, of course it's very inspiring and a new experience to me because I've learned a lot about modern slavery and also I've learned a, a lot about how educational institutions work. This is, this is interesting to me. Yeah, it's like any other experience that you experience in life. It adds a lot for you and it takes also from you. Uh, and as an artist, I mean, what, what do you feel is the, the next thing that you would like to achieve with your work? Where are you going with the painting? Stay fascinated and, and not lose the curiosity in life and in art. <laughs>